Hello guys, how are you? Uh, it's Guli. Uh, this is the fourth session of the Linux Mint tutorial. Today uh, I want to talk about the software manager in Linux Mint, how to install, how to remove software uh, from uh, our uh, operating system. So let's go. Here in the menu bar, uh, you can uh, find the software manager here when you install the Linux Mint. It is here in the favorite bar by default. So this is the icon for the software manager. You can click on that. And after that, uh, you will have a section. You will have a window. So this is the window of the software manager here. By default, every time that you come to this window, you can see some different uh, uh, softwares here, which is uh, suggested by the Linux Mint. So right now you can see the Firefox here in the background and uh, also some editors here. And you by clicking on the Firefox here, you can uh, receive more information about this uh, package about the uh, Firefox uh, so here there are some reviews about this and the number of reviews uh, for this software and also the point and the grade uh, for the, uh, the software and here the remove and the launch icon so right now I have it I have the Firefox so here is launch uh, if I did uh, if I didn't have this one uh, installed so I would receive and I would see here the install uh, button instead of the launch and here there are some categories here for example the phones the games and the graphics the programming so let's go to the games and here we can see yes uh, the board game the first person there are the different uh, types of games here you can search the games uh, and if you're a gamer so you can enjoy that and also you can search uh, here for uh, by the uh, search bar here the name of the game that especially you want and you are looking for uh, so this is the uh, this is uh, for searching the game on Linux and uh, so all the file all the files and all the games that you are looking for you can find here and this icon here uh, if you click on that so you will see a short list uh, and uh, the first one is show installed applications if I click on that I will see the packages uh, that I have that I haven't I installed by myself on Linux Mint? So here there are mm, three packages which I installed them. So you can see the uh, name of the packages here, and also uh, this is one for the refresh, the list of the package. So it would be re refreshed, and also these two lines are search in package summary and search in package description so uh, this one is, by default this one is better because it's a bit faster than this one although both of them are uh, uh, slow but this one the first one search in package summary is a bit faster so uh, let it uh, be on this option by default and also here for example uh, let's uh, go and let's install a software uh, i want to install the whatsapp application uh, so whatsapp uh, we, we should search whatsapp here and here you can see the whatsapp uh, application and the, if you click on that uh, you will see uh, here install because i don't have it uh, on my machine so i click the install here and uh, yes we should wait uh, for the installation it would be finished and uh, also i already told you in last sessions uh, so when you want to install some packages the, the linux will show you okay for installing these packages uh, they are uh, there are some more prerequisites for the packages so and the linux mint uh, is showing you the other packages and you can just uh, click and continue and uh, same as always it will ask uh, you for the password so i enter my password here and also authenticate so uh, i'm waiting for the installation would be finished here uh, it takes a bit time it depends on the size of the package so let's uh, see here also you can uh, click on this uh, circle which is rounding uh, 
by clicking on that you can see the process the software which are uh, you know which are currently being processed here i have just whatsapp so it will show me just the whatsapp software and if i install other applications uh, so it will show me and uh, you so that's it now we can see the package installed so you can see here the remove because we already have the package on our machine so let's go for the package and here you can come uh, and search here in the search bar whatsapp uh, you can see i click on whatsapp here and i'm waiting to you know to application uh, be run yeah here we can see the whatsapp here and uh, right now you can register uh, you know it's related to you how do you want to register here so i don't want to go in detail and so because i want to just ju i just want to show you how to install the softwares okay so after some times uh, you think that okay you don't need the whatsapp more or you need more free space on your machine so you should go to the software manager again here you can uh, remove uh, this package and this software from your machine so in the software manager uh, you can remove it here i will search the whatsapp again whatsapp yeah here you can see it by clicking on that right now you can see this is removed you know in the former session it was installed because i didn't have it on my machine but right now i have it uh, so if i want to remove it from my machine so because of some reasons i just simply click on remove and it, uh, it would uh, it, it is starting to be removed and same as always uh, the password i enter my password and authenticate Yeah, so we should wait to process uh, be finished. Right now, we can see here this is install, and right now we don't have this package on our uh, machine anymore. So it was for this session, and uh, I would uh, ask you please subscribe and like uh, my channel. So and stay with me for the further videos to uh, more uh, information about the Linux Mint. Goodbye.